Man, you're right. The Browns, they suck. It's been, it's been a terrible season. They're always bad. You must be a psychic. What? Yeah. You must be a psychic. Like, you predicted the Browns being bad. Okay. What other uh, predictions do you have? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Well... Cooking show. A cooking show? Yeah. Me? Now. I guess that's the future. Here we are. Welcome to Cooking Well with Thou. Today, I'm going to teach you how to make chicken parm. May not be the best, but it's going to be damn well. Welcome to Cooking Well with Thou. Got to make a sauce. If you want to make a good sauce, you have to have good ingredients. Onion. You cut it as such. This is how you chop an onion. The role of the onion is for sauce. You need to have aromas. So the sauce, it builds from the pot, right? So you put the onion down first with some olive oil, since it's gonna add flavor to the sauce, along with a little bit of garlic. So you're gonna put the onions on there for two to three minutes as they kind of come up the temp. You want them to be translucent. For this recipe, we're going to use the tomato. Open as such, and put the tomatoes in as such. It's like soft core porn. When you're preparing the chicken, first thing you wanna do is trim the fat. Just like anything else in your life, get that bad shit out of there, right? And you do this because when it cooks, it's gonna create a lot of grease. You don't have to get all the fat, but you wanna get some of the fat. Because some of the fat actually leads to flavor. So after the, uh, the fat is trimmed, we're gonna tenderize it with um, whatever the hell this thing's called, right? And that's gonna flatten the chicken, it's gonna allow the seasoning to seep into it, as such. You wanna get it nice and flat, both sides. We just, we just did the beating of the meat. I cook my chicken well. It's because you're watching Cooking Well with Bell. So at this juncture, when you arrive at it, you want to take the chicken and you want to coat it. Now, typically, you would use egg wash. Eggs are goddamn expensive right now, so we're going to use olive oil. It's going to work much the same. and do it just like that, okay? You can get both sides of it. And then you're going to add it to the breadcrumbs. The breadcrumbs are panko, uh, garlic seasoning, a whole bunch of other stuff. Just find, go to your pantry and put what's in there. And then you're just going to repeat this a couple of times until you're done with the cutlets. So what you want to do is preheat the oven to 400 degrees. You're going to cook this for 25 minutes. You then take the cutlets one by one, put it in as such. Now, into the oven, 25 minutes. All right, so from here, about the halfway mark, about 12 minutes into the 25 minute cook time, you're gonna pull the chicken and gently apply the prepared sauce that's been cooking this whole time. Back to the oven we go. Cheese time. So, with about five minutes to go in the cook of the 25 minutes, you're gonna apply the cheese like you do the sauce. Make it nice and equal. All right, finishing touches. You're then gonna plate this onto a plate with your chicken on top, and uh, your chicken parm's gonna be done. Well, here we are, fine folks, enjoying the fruits of our labor, having this wonderful meal. It's the best part about cooking, is enjoying what you eat. Who are you? Freud? Hell are you doing here? Leave. Who invited him? Uh, here we are. Why was Freud here? Did you invite him? I didn't invite that guy. I thought he was dead. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed cooking well with Al. I know I did. We're gonna enjoy this meal. We'll see you next time. <laughs>